Okay, so let's simplify some more expressions and reduce them to terms of sine and cosine. Only. Right away, I'm going to convert tangent squared x into sine squared x over cos squared x. And hopefully that makes sense. Of course, because tangent squared x is basically equivalent to tan of x squared. And tan of x is, of course, it's just sine x over cos x. And we, if we square them both, this would be sine squared x over cos squared x. Okay, back to here. So that's tan squared x right here. And we multiply it by cos squared x. Find sine squared x. The cos squared x are going to cancel out. And we're going to end up with sine squared x minus sine x. So minus sine squared x. Sorry about that. <laughs> Oops. Um, just fix the equal sign. Sine squared x minus sine squared x is equal to zero. Well, oh, that wasn't too bad. Hopefully it made good sense. Now there's many more right here on this website.